So the LG V60 is the most popular phone that I have in my arsenal. I mean, out of over 200 smartphones that I have currently right now, I get the most requests, the most commented videos from LG fans. You know what? I love it. I absolutely love it. So here it is, the new Android 13 update for Verizon wireless customers. I have the uh, LG V60 on T-Mobile, which I received my Android 13 update, uh, but Verizon uh, wireless customers, congratulations to you. For the last few days, you guys been getting a lot of updates and been hitting me in the comments and hit me in my DMs, telling me that they're excited that they receive Android 13 on the Verizon wireless devices. But if you haven't received the update yet, go into your settings, go up top and search update, right? Go to update, uh, let's see, go to update right here and go to system update and it's going to check and see if you have any updates for your LG V60. If you have the update, if you're on Verizon Wireless, go it on and hit the update button and congratulations, you are now going to be on Android 13. Now, one of the questions that I always get is what's new? Now, I've made a complete video on some of the new things that I've found on Android 13. But in this video, I'm going to piggyback on some stuff and show y'all guys some clips of some of the things that I've saw and uh, on Android 13 on my LG V60. So let's have some fun. Sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. So smartphones are very expensive. Look like every year the prices is going up, but here's something you could do right now to save some money. Switch to Mint Mobile, who I'm partnered with with today's video. Listen, Mint Mobile offers premium wireless service for as low as $15 a month. And you know what? You don't have to sacrifice coverage, speed, or data. They're built on the largest 5G network. So why should you pay more? where you could pay less to have access to the same network. One of the good things about Mint Mobile is that you can keep your current device in your current number. So use my link down in the description below to get that premium wireless service starting at $15 a month. I want to give a huge thanks to Mint Mobile for partnering with me in this video. So one of the things that I didn't like about the LG V60 was the fingerprint scanner. It was the slowest fingerprint scanner that I had. Sometimes I just went on and I just used the code to get in. But what Android 13, LG has pulled a miracle in fixing the fingerprint scanner. And I, 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 couldn't, I can't believe that this happened, right? So now the fingerprint scanner here is so good. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that the fingerprint scanner is, 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 I mean, this absolutely great here, right? Uh, and listen, I could not get the fingerprint scanner to work not one time uh, before this new update. And now it's working 100% of the time here, which is great. Now, it's not the fastest, but I'm going to tell you, going from what it was before to where it is now, I will accept this. I don't know what kind of miracle LG did to fix the fingerprint scanner on the LG V60, but I am super impressed overall on what LG have done here with the LG V60. All right, so here it is. Let's go down and talk about some of the unique features that I found with Android 13 on the LG V60. This whole press on your home screen, and now you got the icons at the bottom. Now you had this on Android 12, but look like we may have an addition here with app trash. Not sure if that was there before, but if it was there, I didn't notice it, uh, but it's here now. Uh, and let's go to go to wallpaper and themes. One of the things that I like about this is look at these beautiful wallpapers here, right? So look like you got some good wallpapers here uh, with Android 13, with LG store here uh, that you can download. Now, some of these wallpapers may be with the Android 12 update, and some of these may be some new uh, wallpapers, but I mean, these are absolutely beautiful wallpapers here uh, that's available for free 
for downloading if you want to download some new wallpapers. Also, you have a always on display uh, wallpapers here, which is really nice. So if you want to put some always on display uh, wallpaper here, it's available now uh, on the LG V60, which is absolutely beautiful here. It's all blacked out with some nice little animations here. All right, so here it is, always on display. And if you want to go to icons, you could go to a icon pack if you want to change the stock icons to anything that you want. Now that's available, right here available. Boom. And if you want to theme out your LG V60, now the theme store has Buku themes in here that you could customize your LG V60 to the fullest. So if you want to change everything from the icons to the always on display to theming your whole device, it's available here in wallpapers and themes. Listen, LG have pulled some magic, right? I mean, with every update, I'm getting blazing fast performance from app opening, browser through the OS, smooth the animations, smooth the gameplay, and much more. I mean, listen, this update makes your LG V60 feels like a current device of 2023. Listen, I stand by that because that's how good the performance is on this device. Okay, so this is the best update for the LG V60. But you know what, as you know, Nothing is perfect. So let's talk about the cons. First, this device is still on Wideband L3. All right, so one of the things that concerned me uh, when I received the uh, Android 12 update on my LG V60 is that I had lost the ability of having Wideband L1. Right now, the device is on L3. Even with the new Android 13 update, I have Wideband L3. Uh, so why is that concerning to me? Because right now, even with the update, I am at a wide van L3. So what this does, it tells, you know, Netflix and other, uh, you know, movie sites that this device doesn't support that type of security for video playback. Now, this device was at L1, but it dropped down to L3. So here it is, Android 13 on T-Mobile and Verizon Wireless. Now, if you're an AT&T customer, I don't know when you're gonna get your update, but I wouldn't hold my breath. As you know, AT&T doesn't play fair with legacy devices, just so you know. Uh, so what's next for, for LG, right? What's next for your LG V60? Well, listen to me, y'all. So enjoy your tech, and let's get through to 2023, and we're going to discuss this in 2024. Listen, I will continue to make videos about LG devices, my LG Velvet, the LG Wing, the LG G7, the LG V50, the LG V60. I mean, I have a whole bunch of LG devices. So we're going to have some fun in LG land. Don't forget to subscribe and leave your comments down below. Did you receive your update if you're on Verizon Wireless? Let me know down in the comments. Also, if you don't have the dual screen case for your LG V60, your LG Velvet, right? I have a, a link on my website. I will also leave that link down in the description below because to make your LG V60 or your LG Wing a completed device, listen, the dual case is almost a must, baby. Especially if you like playing games and uh, stuff like that. Also the pen. I will also leave that link down in the description below if you want to pick these items up. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.